I knew at the age of 13 that I was sad because Romeo died, not Juliet. I am from a time before when gay pride was an oxymoron and homophobia the norm. I am forged in that swamp. Community, creativity, and hope were my markers. I'm from the teachers and mentors and heroes who walked beside me, carried me, or urged me lovingly on and showed me ways forward on trails that they often had blazed themselves. I'm safe on my bicycle taking pictures of gardens and I get lost in the beauty that surrounds me. I am adamant that society must change. I'm adamant that my queer family is fabulous, warts and all. I'm adamant that humans are all simply reaching out hoping for connection and love. I love to dance outside at Pride and be a part of that rainbow. I love to pack a picnic and enjoy the view of the forest or the ocean or humanity. I love to create events which are fun, inclusive and help bring folks together. Creating a space for people to come together is my nirvana. I am from another pandemic that tried to destroy my family and our world. I come from that fight and that huge burden of loss. I am from the memory of so many dear, dear lost friends and their passions and their laughter. I say their names to bring them forward and to honor their memory. Without the storm, there can be no rainbow. Separate but equal, isn't equal. What do I hope? I hope my stories and experiences and agitation help create a world where homophobia never gets an opportunity to take a foothold inside a younger person's soul. I am loved deeply, and that is startling and revelational to me. I have worked hard and will continue to do so to make that less startling. It's a life's work, but the important things always are.